Hey guys, welcome back to another video with Oz Gaming guys. So guys, this video is all about the GTA 5 patch 1.16 first person glitch, guys. So before we start this video, guys, if you guys don't mind by hitting that like button, support me and basically that's it guys that's all I'm asking for if we can get 10 likes on this video it would be highly appreciated guys so let's get into the video so first of all you need to come to this carnival area down on the map near the beach around here and just go to there and you'll see the ferris wheel and head to that direction So, as soon as you get out of your car, run to the Ferris wheel. Keep running, 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 running. And as soon as you see the Ferris wheel, if you can see the Ferris wheel stops. Yeah. Now, in a second, if I turn off, don't press your right on the D-pad yet. Press it about now, should say stopping. And uh, bring up your inventory interaction whatever you want to call it and come down to kill yourself okay kill yourself and as soon as you get as close as you possibly can press it because the glitch is that they patched it you can't stand there anymore and press it that's rockstar's patch that so this way is you can get as close as possible and you gotta press a like this get up close as soon as you hit the top step press a straight away like this bang maybe not it takes a little bit guys and Took me about three turn goes to get this. It's harder than what you think because they patched it. So no, I don't want to ride the Ferris wheel. Anyway, come this way. So as usual, come up here and you stop it. Interaction menu. Come to kill yourself. I'm gonna try the second step now. And kill myself on the second step. As soon as you get the second step, kill yourself and hold in Y straight away. Hold in Y. If you don't hold in Y, it won't work. And you press back, and your interaction menu can't pop up. Means that first part is done. You've done it correctly. Just run to the roller coaster, and this is where the glitch starts. For the second part. Just run up the steps. And this costume, guys, this is part of the new DLC pack. It's, I think it was cost about 50 grand, 50, 60 grand for this costume, but yeah, a lot of money. So, it's coming down now. And I don't think it doesn't matter where you sit, but I like to sit in the second row because it works. So, when the second row comes up, do you want to ride? Press yes, basically, right on your D pad for Xbox. Should spawn you there, then now you're in the first wheel. You just press back on your D pad and press right on your D pad. So, it will say the ride will stop in the next rotation. So as soon as you get about mid height, it will basically move you somewhere. Like there you go, first person has been viewed. Press back on your D-pad very soon, as soon as it gets to the top. And that's your first person has started. Just need to get off. I just leave it as that, because then I know. As, yeah, I can see myself around the corner there. With my hands sticking up. Yep. Shouldn't take too long, guys. I do apologize if this is taking too long. As soon as it gets about to the top, you should be able to move it.
Where am I? Okay, cool. There you go. Now I'm outside. On top of the roller coaster. After the roller coaster has done one full turn, it goes like that. Now this is where the tricky part gets into play. Now I've got to find out where I am. Yeah, go down that way. There you go. Now I know where I'm going. So this is your first person. Looks mad. Already. Jump it. There you go. And you run. To a car. So guys, it, for this glitch, you can only go in the carnival area. If you exit the carnival area, the glitch will stop. Basically, get in the car. Some cars will glitch out. Some cars won't. Because you're not supposed to be looking inside of them. But, this car is okay. Just go for a drive now. It'd be good for YouTube videos, guys. So you can have some fun with them. and Yeah. So, guys, I'll show you how far you can get out until you get kicked out. You're first person. So, right up here, you should be getting kicked out in a second. Now, see? Now you kicked out a first person. That's it. Now, the only way to bring out your interaction menu again, guys, is to leave the game and come back in. So Rockstar has patched that, but you have to get out of the game and come back in and then it finally works again. And that's basically it guys, and you're done. So thanks for watching guys, if you guys can leave a like in the bottom and just comment, we highly appreciate it guys. Thanks for watching, this is Oz Gaming guys. Everybody put your hands in the air. Oh, oh.